Here we go, round two. Well, round two recorded anyway. All right, welcome back, Caves of Cud. Doing some random run-throughs. Beginner just started playing the game in 20, late 2023, a few weeks ago. And um, yeah, here we go. We're just gonna do another round here and jump straight in. So we're doing classic permadeath, and we will do new, semi-random. So we're gonna mutate human, Arcanaut. And then we're going to randomize from here on. Esper, what does that mean? You only manifest mental mutations, and all of your mutation choices when manifesting a new mutation are mental. Okay, so psychic mutation. Well, we've got cryokinesis, so that's ice. Disintegration, you disintegrate nearby matter. Area of 7x7 seven seven around self. Damage to non structural objects is 1d10 plus 2. Nice. <clears throat> cool down 75 rounds, yeah, okay, so basically, force blast disintegrates shit around me. Force bubble, force field around yourself, it's free free force field, centered on yourself, duration 13 rounds, you may fire we mis weapon missiles. Missile weapons, more like, through the force field, okay. Sense psychic, you can send up a mental mutants, that's okay. Um, what have we got here, this technica, this technia. We are befuddled by technology and complexity. Okay. Technology me scared of. I'm alright with that. Bad at examining artifacts. You can't have artifacts identified for you because you don't understand their explanations. When you fail severely during artifact examination, the artifact explodes. Interesting. That could cause us some issues, but let's do it. So basically, I'm a dumb psychic. Sounds fun. Okay, so what we got? Okay, pretty standard across the board. Ego and agility is my two top ones. I'm fine with that. Let's crack on. There we go. Right. Get moving. Name. Let's call us Claire Buoyant. No offence to clairvoyance. Okay, a little bit of offence to clairvoyance. I don't believe. Chopper! Cool. Let's go. <clears throat> Here we go. And let's start moving along. So, speak to Mimit. Search for work. Happy days. Get that quest. Do a water ritual with the guy. Live and drink, brother. I'm working on it, man. Stop asking me. Hello, mate. Yeah, cool. That's standard. Live and drink. Elder. Live and drink, bro. Show me how to harvest stuff. Thanks. Live and drink. Off you pop. Right. Okay, let's... Wait, I don't know why I do this every time. I don't think I actually need to, but I guess it's... What does it do? I forgot to look. It gives me some percentage bonuses. 15 plus percent to natural healing. And you first at half the rate. Yeah, so it is worth doing. Cool. Right. Rob my new friends. This is the way. Oh, this has got a lot of stuff in it. Small gold flex tube. Weird artifact. Okay, so basically this is going to... I'll try and do an examination of one of these. But this is where we're going to struggle. But it does mean that I can just give them to our guy and be none the wiser. This is where I find out that that would have been the best artifact that I've had so far. You go away, door. Happy days. Anything in any of these bits? Nope. And nope. Oh, long sword, 1d4, that could be potentially good. Go speak to Argive. I shall return with your knickknacks, sir. Here is your knickknacks, sir. Um, actually, wait, before I do that, let's see what happens. Small gold fleck tube. 
E. No. Space. Examine X. That's it. Brilliant. Is he now going to be hostile? Yeah. You died. You were killed by Argive. <laughs> okay. <laughs> so... <laughs> Oh, I can't believe that just happened. That's brilliant. I think Argive actually survived that as well. <laughs> so, yeah. So, basically, I run in, realise that I'm a technophobe, decide to do the thing that it warned me not to do immediately, and then kill the main quest giver. Well, try to hurt the main quest giver. He then kills me. Fantastic work. Okay, well, that is kind of the rule of this thing. Once the run is over, we stop the video and we'll start a new one. Um, I might run another video again just because this one was comically quite slow. Uh, quick, sorry. And um, But yeah, I'll see you in the next one. And uh, I hope you learned something. <laughs> Alright, bye-bye everyone.